briefcase, briefs, and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. In 1962, the North Dakota Supreme Court heard the case of Kutsara v. Kutsara, which centered on the legal assumption that a child born during a marriage belongs to both spouses unless proven otherwise. The couple at the heart of the case had a tumultuous marriage, which ultimately ended in divorce. The wife accused her husband of causing her extreme emotional harm, while the husband alleged infidelity and cruelty on her part. Complicating matters, the wife gave birth to a child fathered by another man just seven months into the marriage. She insisted that her ex-husband be required to provide financial support for the child. The lower court granted the divorce in favor of the wife and ordered the husband to financially support her and both children. The husband appealed arguing that he should not be held responsible for the child who was not biologically his, and that the court's judgment regarding the divorce and custody was incorrect. In its decision, the North Dakota Supreme Court ordered the district court to review the child support issue, denied divorce to both parties, and awarded custody of the child to the wife. The court also stipulated that the custody arrangement could be modified if it was found to not be in the best interest of the child. So much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit lse.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.